First off, I'm going to say Shalom. 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 We give all praises to Yahweh, Ba'ashem, Yahweh Shai, Ba'ashem, Makar Kodash. Double honors to the apostles and elders of Great Millstone and salutations to you, sincere brothers, faithfully and diligently pushing this truth with fear and trembling through the spirit and power of Yahweh, Ba'ashem, Yahweh Shai. All right, we the GMS Memphis Count. All right, to my left. Karab. On my nah. All right, and I'm the brother Tazamak. All right, coming at you, uh, you know, real quick with a Lord willing edifying lesson before we head out to camp. You know, we're going to uh, entitle this lesson, some dealing with fear. It may be, you know, maintaining the fear factor, you know, just on my spirit, you know. Uh, I had some weird ass dream, man. I woke up this morning, I was like, man, that's that fear, you know, because the, the Lord can put all types of judgment on us, man. All right. So it's very important that we maintain the fear factor, all right? Because that's the very principal thing of this truth into receiving understanding, all right? And, and to maintaining uh, the Lord's mercy, obtaining the Lord's mercy, man, all right? As it says, what? Wisdom and knowledge shall be the stability of our times. Well, how are you going to obtain that wisdom, knowledge, and understanding? All right, let's get it. This is what? Also known as Ecclesiasticus 19 and 18. He said, The fear of the Lord, Yahweh Shemashat, is the first step to be accepted of him. Mm -hmm. That's yes. the first step, man. All right. The first step of being accepted of the Most High is not to love him, but to fear him. He said, In wisdom, obtaining his love. Wisdom, obtaining his love, man. You know, so that's, like I said, I woke up, I, and that's how it, it happened a lot. I just have certain things that uh, come on my spirit, and then I start with a title. So, you know, like I said, somewhere in the realm of maintaining the fear factor, man, you know, because that is the most important thing of this truth. Okay. Is it more? I'm going to jump down to 20. They say, on the fear of the Lord, it, it's like the fear of the Lord is all wisdom. And all wisdom is the performance of the law and the knowledge of it. Oh, let's see. Yeah, yeah. Uh, uh, read it again. Okay. So right, 19 and 20. It said, the fear of the Lord is all wisdom. And, and all wisdom is the performance of the law. And all wisdom is what? The, the perform performance of the law. All right? So what? Give what? Diligence to make our call and election sure. That's a commandment. Uh -huh. All right? Uh, 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 fear the most high and keep his commandments That's the conclusion of the whole matter Alright This whole book is a book of laws, statutes, commandments Guidelines, morals, principles Alright That we ought to live by Because what? We fear the wrath of Yahweh Shai If uh -huh. we do not do the things that he bid us to do man. Uh -huh. Alright It's that in the knowledge of it Oh Omnipotency. In the knowledge of his omnipotency. The key word in omnipotency is potency. All right? Potency. The Lord has an unlimited amount of power, man. His power is omnipotent, man. All right? So that ties in to the kind of judgment that he can unleash on any one of us, man. All right? At his disposal because he do he does what he wants, man. Okay. All right. But the understanding that we must have is that if we do those things that please him, all right, get that second Corinthians. All right, this is second Corinthians five and ten. For we must all appear before the judgment seat of Hamashiach, mm -hmm. that everyone may receive the things done. In his body, mm -hmm. according to that he have done, whether it be good or bad. See, mm -hmm. so we have to understand that we have to maintain that fear, man. Don't get complacent, all right. And always have your mind uh, uh, constantly meditating on the judgment of the Lord. You know, this is Sirach. Uh, Thirteen. It's twelve. Let's see if I can find it. Page twenty-one. It's a lot of 
Okay, this is a uh, this is Sirach twenty one and eleven. He that keepeth the law of the Lord getteth the understanding thereof, and the perfection of the fear of the Lord is wisdom. So we have to understand that there's a perfect a fear of the Lord, man, in order to get that understanding. And it says that it comes from the performance of the law, man. You know? That's very important. I'm going to read verse 13. Uh, verse 12. It says, He that is not wise will not be taught. But there is a wisdom which multiplied bitterness, man. Okay? And that's the thing, you know. The, the more that you learn, the more that you uh, uh, grow with uh, wisdom and knowledge and understanding uh, through the Spirit, you know, you become bitter. So, you know, it says uh, that wisdom multiplies uh, sorrows, man. You know? Uh -huh. So, you understand that the position that we're in as the sons of, of, of Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shah, all right, as, as Israel, that we are out of course. That we are out of our position, man. And we see the wickedness that's being. Uh, Constantly multiplied in the earth and say what wickedness has exceedingly polluted the earth and all her uh, what is it all her, her works are fulfilled yeah. Yeah. you know and every day you turn on the news every time you go on social media you you see some form of wickedness man wickedness but that's not a small thing for your Bashim Yahushua to give you over unto that if you do not continually fear him man you know uh, they're going to that talent too you know. When uh, we, uh, but the talents when the uh, guy that um, told the Lord, I feel because you was an austere man, mm -hmm. you know. Hey, this let you know the Lord, he he rough, you know. And hey, but right. people ain't you know ain't doing the work, man. Lord gonna cast you cast you away, man. Mm -hmm. You know you ain't bringing in fruit, man. That's a fearful thing, man. You looking back, you know. <laughs> That's it, man. This is a rock. Did you have some? If whoever had something, go ahead. I, I just got one. I'll get mine next. I got Psalms 111 and 10. The fear of the Lord is the beginning of wisdom. Mm -hmm. A good understanding have all day that do his commandments. His praise endure forever. So in saying maintaining the fear is just like, man, that's how you're going to maintain your wisdom. You know, if you ever get in, a, in, a, in that point to where you get complacent and you, you, you stop, you know, uh, Fearing the Lord, the Lord going to take this wisdom away from you, man. You know? Uh, hey, come on. We're ready to wrap it up. Come on, let's do it. Uh, this is Psalm 64 and 9. It said, And all men shall fear and shall declare the work of Yahweh Shemashai, for they shall rise to the consider of his doing. Oh, man. Read that again. He said, in all, Psalm 64 9, and all men should fear and should declare the work of Yahweh Shemashai, for they shall wisely consider of his doing, you know? For they shall wisely consider. That's their fear. Mm -hmm. You know, you shall wisely consider your ways, man, and things that we, that we do. All right? As they say, we're going to be judged according to the things that we do in our vessel, you know? Uh, you had something? Go ahead, Al. No, yeah, yeah. Uh, Proverbs 8 and Proverbs 8 and 13 The fear of the Lord Is to hate evil <laughs> Pride And arrogance In the evil way man, the that pride is a motherfucker man Arrogance We say knowledge puffeth up You know Hey the most high got us In a position to where We have to stay balanced You know You, you, you take that That uh that seesaw up That that pride, that pride will lift you up, you know. Yep. If you get on that seesaw and you don't balance your life out right, man, you know, it's that fear, okay, that, that keeps us balanced. Come on. Scripture say, you know, uh, the Lord is a terrible power, man, you know. Come on. That's it, man. You should know that the Lord can bring, can give you over, you know, through that riverbank uh, spirit, you know. Mm -hmm. Yep. And that's why we have to, uh, you know, always know that 
the elect are only known of the most high. All right. Don't just have have hope, but don't get uh overly confident that, oh yeah, I know I'm I'm the elect, you know. I, I do you know your works don't even matter, man. Yep. You know? Your works are a testament of your faith. All right, because if you got faith and you're obedient, then you're gonna do the works. Sure. But man, hey, hey brothers, fall out of this thing, man, years and years of work that they put in and if they if you fall out it's all vain you know it's, it, it it don't mean nothing man all right and it's just to show you that we all working for the same penny the lord say you're gonna have uh his elect gonna come in in the final hour man all right it's more yeah and the forward mouth do i hate that's it yep this is uh what you say? I would just say like the um, scripture go back in the apocalypse. They say uh, it's one that teach it, but now unto itself, you know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, uh, and that's a fearful thing. The Lord is not a uh, respectful person, you know. Yeah. That's why we should all, you know, always keep that humbleness and balance, man. Stand humble, praying, and fasting, you know. That mm -hmm. go back to Psalms fifty one eleven, man. Yep. Take not that Holy Spirit away, away, man. Every brother sh should know that scripture, all right. Memorize it. And, uh, you know, really uh, in the Hebrew too, man, you know. Sure. Uh, it took me a while to learn it, but I finally did, you know. And I, and I know how important it is to pray to the Most High to keep us, man, you know. You got to pray, pray. I said us. You got to pray for the brothers around you too, you know, that the Spirit stay on them. Sure. Uh, just like the brother was saying, he was quoting that, uh, that's a rock. Uh, we say uh, there's one that is wise and teacheth many, but he teach it to many but he's unprofitable to himself yes, you know so don't get full of yourself because the lord will use you all right to teach and then if you're not doing is because you could be teaching and not living by the things that you're teaching out of your own mouth man oh. all right that's that's vanity man you know the lord he, he don't have no purpose for you you know other than <laughs> he gave you that knowledge to to, to give to others and for a time, uh, 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 be be uh, a mouthpiece for him, you know. This is a uh, Sirach one and eighteen. The fear of the Lord is a crown of wisdom, making peace and perfect health to flourish. Both which are the gifts of Yahweh Bashi and Yahweh So you gotta understand, this is the Lord said He give it and He take it away, man. All right, a gift is something that is given, but the Lord will take away that which He uh, 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 gave you if you don't be profitable, like the uh, the parable in Luke the nineteenth chapter, man. All right, like the fruits, you yep. know, yeah. not bringing in fruits. Yeah, it says uh, it says, and it enlarged their rejoicing that love Him, man. You know. Is it, uh, but we got something else? I got one more. Go okay. Ahead. Proverbs 16 and 6. By mercy and truth, iniquity is purged, and by the fear of the Lord, men depart from evil. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You know? Go ahead, bro. It's, uh, you're going to watch. You're going to watch your whereabouts. You're going to watch your surroundings. You're going to be circumspect all because of the fear of the Lord. Uh, Ecclesiastes 12 and 13. Let us hear the conclusion of the whole matter. Fear your how about Shimon Shai and keep his commandments, for this is the whole duty of man. And you have to live with that fear, all right? That's the whole, that's the first, it said, the, the, the first scripture we read was in Sirach. It said the first yeah. thing is fear, and the last thing, the conclusion of the whole matter is fear, yeah. all right? So maintain that fear, Akim. Lord willing, this was edifying through the spirit and power of your heart by Shimmy Hau Shai. Call Halal Yulal Yahweh by Shimmy Hau Shai. Right with Kaha Kodash. Double honors, apostles, and elders of Great Millstone. Quam Yasharala. Abal Babal. Rise Israel, destroy confusion. Shalom. Shalom.